dress behind me, I don't know why. Maybe there is some sort of a festivity or protest. Otherwise, but I feel it's gonna be interesting. Am I the only Hare Krishna here? I'm not sure. Whoever thinks that they have made a gain and a victory through their despotic actions should know. So, so why do you follow the Vedic way? I mean, it's interesting. Um, I'm not saying you shouldn't follow it. If you want, if you feel comfortable with it, it's your choice, it's your life. Yeah, well, I but why do you choose to follow it? From the speech of Sayyidah Zainab Salam Alayha, your time is coming. This life is very short. 50 years time, let's say 100 years time, maybe apart from one or two babies here, none of us are going to be here. Hey, hey, hey. Inshallah. Hi. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> All right, so we in speakers on the way to speakers corner. Everyone on the channel desired me to go and visit. Let's see why you desired that so much. I'm in complete anticipation what is going on out there. I checked that already on the web on YouTube. It's pretty much uh, many people debating, most of them are Muslim. And I'm not surprised because on the way here, pretty much as soon, the closer we get to the corner, more and more uh, Muslim businesses are operating. It's literally just McDonald's and different Muslim restaurants and pharmacies. And there's, there, there are many, many ladies and Muslim dress behind me, I don't know why. Maybe there is some, some sort of a festivity or protest otherwise but i feel it's going to be interesting what do you say it's going to be interesting right right of course every day is interesting in london Hi there. Do you know why there's so many people there? Um, yeah, yeah I'm, I actually wanted to ask. Yeah, yeah, sure. Why, what's so, the reason for the event today? Yeah, uh, basically, this is a commemorate. You, would you like to participate on the camera? Uh, no, no, thank no you. Personally, no. Wow, just got here and already got some gifts. Some epic gifts. Oops, sorry. I think there's there's going to be little debating here at this on this weekend. Uh, 
Am I the only am I the only Hare Krishna here? I'm not sure. Alhamdulillah, inshallah. No, it is so weird. So already got some nice gifts, you can see. Nice flower, we're gonna offer it to Krishna and some juice. Oh, epic, I love it. Um, sorry, is that speaker's corner? Speaker's Corner? This is not Speaker's Corner oh, okay. itself. Speaker's Corner okay. is, is across the road. I cross the road. Is yeah, this yeah. like straight? Yeah, yeah. But there is a speech going on right now if you wanted to listen. Okay, yeah, sure, yeah, sure. So, um, oh, you've got, a, you've got a gift. Did yes. somebody talk to you about what's going on? Uh, I think, yeah, it's about uh, a saint called Hussein. Yes, right? exactly. That you commemorate his so uh, message today. Yeah, we're remembering him mm -hmm. and he stood for justice. Okay. And he he, uh, he was a very important person in our, in our religion. Yeah. I know one of the names of Allah is the most just, right? Yes, how do you yeah. say? Um, actually, I don't know how I don't know Arabic very well. Ah, okay, so. but one of the ninety-nine one, names. One of the ninety-nine. Al Haym Al Karim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Al, uh, maybe Saddam. No, Saddam. No, no it's no, not. No, Saddam it's not. is a different name. No, completely okay. different. But um, there's some English speeches going mm -hmm. on. Okay, there's a speech going on. Let's check it out together. Fill your worldly desires with a, a bit of worldly power. Whoever thinks that they have made a gain and a victory through their despotic actions should know from the speech of Sayyidah Zainab Salam Alayha, your time is coming. Whoever is oppressing anybody here today, whoever is oppressing your family members, People in Kashmir, I know someone personally being cut off from her family in Kashmir. People whose relatives are in prison or at the risk of being killed and assassinated. This life is short. The victory is to come. And another thing from Sayyidah Zainab Salam Alayha as she warned Yazid in the mosque of Bani Omeya. She said that you can't cry to listen because the troubles are inevitable. And Imam al Sadiq has said He said if you become one of our followers, then expect trouble, expect poverty. Expect isolation, expect attacks. He said, and if this does not happen to you, then we would not consider you as one of us. So this goes with the territory, as they say. There's a constant attempt to put a cloud of spiritual darkness over the people who love light. And our youth are feeling this today with the rise of depression among is the message that you cannot extinguish this light. And as long as we have this nur in our heart, this life is very short. 50 years time, let's say 100 years time, maybe apart from one or two babies here, none of us are going to be here. We're just traveling through. We take the bala, you take the trouble, but you stand strong. Anyone who's trying to humiliate you, anyone who's trying to humiliate the women of this ummah scattered in different refuge attributes, you can't humiliate someone's spirit. You can't humiliate someone's soul. So we walk in remembrance of that terrible massacre. Okay, there wasn't actually speaker's corner. Uh, there was uh, an event for Hussein. Perhaps we're going to link in the description more explanation about it. Speech quite fascinating. Can let me know down in the comments what do you think? You ask for it, so we made it. We're here in speaker's corner. Let's see what's happening there. <laughs> Uh, 
I, I hope it's more than just a bunch of guys shouting at each other. <laughs> on, on, on YouTube I've seen some nice discussions, some sober discussions. There's a policeman around us, yay, Hare Krishna. Ow, everyone with the cameras. So it's okay to chant. I thought, I thought they're not gonna allow chanting here, but everyone is chanting. La 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 la. Jesus is the savior. Only the Hare Krishnas are missing. Where are all the Hare Krishnas? Hey, Hare Krishna. Krishna. What's going on here, man? What, what, what is in the corners about today? Well, usually uh, it's Muslims and Christians at each other's throats. So Mostly Muslims and Christians. Mainly, yeah. Okay. yeah. Are there like more philosophical discussions? There are, yeah. Non-feminism over there. Feminism, okay. Non-feminism. Non Non-feminism. Yeah, um, <laughs> non well, yeah, you do get some political stuff, but it's usually okay, religious. Okay, what's your name? Alex. Alex, nice to meet you. Rama, Rama Chandra. Rama, how are you doing? I'm The Living Monk. You can find me on YouTube like that. Rama. Ra uh, my YouTube channel, The Living Monk. The Living Monk. Yes, okay, no, right. Right. Come on. Oh, it's like Krishna. Epic, thanks. Yeah, it's cool. It's my first time here. Okay, well, I'm welcome from... to the madhouse. Oh, nice. <laughs> Epic. <Yeah. laughs> Feels lively already. You from the States? Uh, no, Montreal, Canada. Oh, I beg your pardon. Okay. No problem. Yeah, oh, cool. You're here just visiting. I thought there will be actually, because uh, I know in Queen, this is a Queen's Park, right? Yeah. In Queen's Park, it's illegal to do like official prayer or chanting. Well, and things yeah, like that. they did have a problem with people doing their call to prayer here. They had to yeah. stop it. Okay. But it, this is all right. They kind of allow it, really. Yeah. But. They're all, they're all chanting the names of God, which is great. I yeah, it's good. It but it feels a bit of an argument, don't you feel so? Well, yeah, absolutely. They, they yeah. each think the other one's going to hell, so... <laughs> I mean, that's the Abrahamic religions for you, right? They're very oh, hellfire right. and brimstone. Yes, yes. Uh, I mean, yeah. I, I know that uh, the Hindu... Uh, I know it's a little bit more complex than that. The truth is that it's one and different. So everywhere there is truth mm. and everywhere there is no truth. It's like mixed. Mm. Achintya Beda Abheda Tatva. Okay. You know, like uh, Jesus is, he says, I'm the Son of God, and the, many Christians they say he is God, so we agree. Yes. Because the Son and the Father, they uh, resonate each other. Yes. But at the same time, there is a relationship. And without, without, without different personalities, there is no meaning to relationship. So maybe we'll meet some famous YouTubers. I heard there are a few famous Muslim YouTubers that hang out here every Sunday. Uh, let's see, maybe there's someone cool. Hey, I like your hoodie. Oh, Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. You see? Krishna <laughs> says, I'm in anyone's heart and I direct everyone. So he texts me very fast that I come here. I'm uh, from the Living Monk channel. You go on YouTube sometimes? YouTube, yeah, I do. Yeah. You can subscribe. Living Monk. What are you talking about here? And now I'm going to demonstrate. Okay, Christians. As a Christian, do you believe in your Bible? Yes or no? As interpreted by the Greeks, they wrote the first Bible in Greek language. Excuse me, what's wrong with you? We are trying to speak. Yeah, but this guy is a Christian. Yeah, so what? That is gonna. Yeah, don't worry. You are a Jewish. Have some manners. Okay. Who wrote your Bible? Mr. Jew, you have some manners. The first okay. people who wrote the Bible, they were Greeks. Excuse me, don't you Jews have manners? After the death of General Excuse me. He's going to be gentle, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very gentle. Yeah, yeah. Very gentle. Very gentle. Very gentle. Very gentle. Okay, someone invited me for a talk. So where are you from? Oh, I'm from the spiritual world. You're from the spiritual world? Yes. Which spiritual world? Uh, where every talk is a song and every walk is a dance. Uh, uh, yeah. Hare Krishna. Hey, how's it going? Okay, so I'm someone invited me for a talk. It's it's my first talk. American. American? Oh my Some god. American accent. Uh, oh, oh, I got many of them. Yeah. What, else, what, them. what else accents you got? But that's my first time here. Is it for, oh, so, uh, it's our first time. So I hope my friend is going to be we gentle only come with here me. Every, 
two months. So we're what's, not. what's the name of sir that's going to talk to me? I'll give you a card. He looks like he has a good name. Uh, he's no good name. No, why? <laughs> why do you because say like this about like, him? We're same as you. You record your name. So we're here with Shabir. He's going to... Sorry, brother. We're going to have a talk about... I don't know what's the topic, but it seems like a nice guy, so I think it's going to be very... Very productive. We have viewers, cameras. For my first talk, there is already so many cameras. Wow. Yeah, so sorry, Rama. How old are you? Okay, so I'm Rabbi. So rabbis in Judaism who say that Christianity is heresy, it's paganism, there's a trinity. There were other rabbis. Read the Bible, Quran, or Torah? Would know. Okay, you say right, cool. How about this? You said, 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 Oh, we should. Yeah, thank you. Tell me next. There is a condition. Do you know the condition? No, there's no condition. But Muslims lie about the Quran like this man here. I promise you in the Quran, it just says the children of Israel will. The word he is likely to have used for God is Ilahi, according to the New Testament, which is very close to the word Allah or Allahumma or Ilahim. Anyone with two brain cells can see the similarity. Allahumma, Elohim, Ilahi, Ilaha, they all come from the same root word. This is what we're trying to explain to these people, that Yahweh is not, um, is not um, a point in your favor. Rather, it goes against you because we have no idea what language Moses spoke. Uh, they think it was Hebrew. No, there's no evidence. We don't even know if Hebrew language existed in the 13th, 14th century BC, in the, in the Middle Old Kingdom. Uh, during the Egyptian period. We have no evidence that the Hebrew language actually existed as it exists today. We have no evidence. The Arabic language is a living language because of the Quran. Okay, Quran, uh, you are Hindu, right? I, no, I don't. I consider myself a follower of the Vedic scriptures. Okay. Uh, Hindu, okay. So far I'm concerned, is, Hindu is a term, term that doesn't exist in the Vedas. It's something that was brought up around 500 years ago by the Persians. By the colonial, no, even, yeah, you're right, I agree. Even during the British period, it was it was used in the way it is used today because Vedic people were never uh, a monolith. They were never one. They, they all followed different philosophies, different things, and I, I, I see your point. So, so why do you follow the Vedic way? I mean, it's interesting. Um, I'm not saying, you shouldn't follow it if you want, if you feel comfortable with it it's your choice it's your life yeah well I but why there, do you choose to follow it i find there's something which i see which is is missing in many many paths is uh, the um, name of god and on well, the name of god like you yourself spoke with the gentleman is actually is in the quran right the 99 things uh, Allah, 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 Allah. and uh, um, but we have something like a, a little extra is the the form of God, how it looks like, his uh, um, adjectives, his, his qualities too, there are 99 names, they explain that, but we have the information about his personality. And where do you get this information from? In our scriptures. And claim to know a lot about it, I don't actually, uh, you can teach me on that. Um, but it seems to be quite distinct from... You should oh, be vegan. Okay. Yeah. Well, you might, you might be uh, Of course. Yeah. We flipped. Oh, thanks. Thank you. Hey. Hey, how's it going? We're here with. What's your good name, sir? Jack. Jack, nice yeah. to meet you, Rama. Rama Chandra. I'm the living mic. You can find me on YouTube, Instagram, and that. You have a YouTube channel yeah, too? Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's called Humane Hancock. Uh, Human Hancock? Yeah. Humane. Humane oh, Hancock. Yeah. That's a cool name. And <laughs> what inspired you in your pursuit? Is it political, religious, ideological, or Yeah, everything? so it's, uh, it's an ethical stance. Ethical, uh, okay. And it's a stance that I, I believe that animals aren't here to be exploited by us. Oh, Their sorry. lives don't belong to us. Yeah. So that's for food. For oh, fashion, yeah. for for whatever it is, entertainment. Anything, yeah, you know, like, actually, some religions they say they that God gave us dominion over them. Right. But I tell them back that you know, even if He did, it doesn't mean that we should act as superior. Like right. if you think about it, if someone gives you dominion over, like let's say you're you're my boss, but you like sexually harass me or you do something to me which is 
on, on, on that team pain, you know, yeah. then you're going to be and prosecuted. It, and in the same way, I usually say, well, well, God has dominion over us. And if yeah. you think he treats us with compassion, why shouldn't we treat the animals with compassion? And killing an animal when they don't want to die, killing them when they're babies, none of this screams out compassion. It's more screaming out and causing unnecessary suffering. That's what it's about. And um, being surrounded by, like, mostly I can see, this is my first time here, actually. I'm, I'm from Canada, from Montreal. And I see that it's mostly, like, Muslims and Christian and other religions. Uh, how did it make you uh, feel? Like, do you feel supported in your ideas here? Or uh, are there any, like, here? Be, here, speakers corner. Mostly not. Mostly not supported. It's mostly people come here to debate. Yes. Um, but I don't only have these conversations for the people I'm talking to. I'm also doing it for the people who watch online. Oh, and I okay. want to show that there aren't any good arguments against veganism. Oh, that's a good point. What's the What's the best counter argument you received so far? Oh, there, there aren't any. Not especially not here. I mean, generally here you're.